Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you two tiny Excel functions which will save you a lot of time while you are doing a data cleaning in MS Excel. One is a trim function and another is that a proper function. So before we begin, let me just quickly show you the raw data available on the screen, right? So here you can see there are some spaces added, added over here. Some sort of capitalization. A couple of are showing in a small case. One of these are showing in a capital case, right? So we have to normalize that. If we use sorting over here, adding a filter, right? It will not really work. It will just show like this. Okay, it will not really work. So in this case, what we can do, we can use these two functions. So first we'll begin with a trim function. So I will simply add a trim over here. Okay, and I'll select this A2 and uh, I'll hit a enter button. Okay, what exactly it does? It removes the extra spaces before and after or maybe within a word. This stream, I will just do a control D over here. You can see wherever it's extra spaces added, those spaces got removed automatically. Right, let's jump on the next function called proper function. Okay, now let's look at the proper function over here. I'll just type here simply proper, and here we can select this and bracket close, and I'll hit a enter button. Okay, as soon as I hit a enter button, you can see the first letter of that specific word which is allies. You can see it's been capitalized. However, when I see the spaces, right, those are not getting online automatically do that what we have to do we have to combine this both your proper plus your trim okay so when we combine this both we get a appropriate result then and there i'll quickly show you that as well okay so we don't have a space here to write in so that's what i'm just adding a here okay is equal to proper first okay this is the proper which is capitalizing your each word right and then uh, we'll add a trim function over here the same trim function which we have used initially just add this bracket close bracket close and i'll hit a enter button over here okay and i'll do a control d once again boom you can see before and after scenario right so if i do control c and control v over here Okay, and I'll just do a white color over here. Boom, you can see the result over here. Isn't that great? I hope you found this useful, folks. So please don't forget to subscribe us. Thanks for watching. Have a great day ahead.